you know that you might be living with someone or something that has a superpower that can lower blood pressure, reduce stress and even heal broken bones? That's right, a cat. If you live with a cat, like Ted or Ziggy, then you'll already know how great cats are. But Ted and other cats are giving researchers hard scientific evidence that actually proves they're more than just great friends. Because cats purrs, as it turns out, have healing powers that help them and us to stay healthy. First though, how do cats purr? A cat purrs by contracting and relaxing the muscles in its throat and diaphragm really fast to make them vibrate. And when she breathes in and out, air hits those vibrating muscles and makes that fluttering, purring sound. And that's one of the things that makes a cat's purr special. The fact that he can make this sound by breathing in and out. The other thing that makes the sound special is that every individual cat purrs at a different frequency. So Ted's purr is totally different from Ziggy's and from Daisy's. But why do cats purr at all? Well, Ted definitely purrs when he's happy. And kittens purr when they're suckling, probably to let their mothers know that everything's fine. But this is where things get interesting. You see, cats purr when they want us to feed them. But this purr is no ordinary purr. It's a special sound that taps into your deepest and oldest nurturing instinct. Because it contains a cry that's similar to this cry. Yes, the cry of a hungry human baby. So when you hear that purr, well, who can resist? Cats also purr when they're scared or in pain, or when they're stimulated or alert. Which brings me to those superpowers I mentioned at the start. Veterinarians noticed that when dogs and cats were brought in with broken bones, cats actually healed faster. And they think it might be all because of that purr. Cats purr at a frequency of between 20 and 140 hertz. And this exact range seems to help bones knit together and repair themselves. And it increases bone density. This frequency range also helps to fight infection, as well as heal ligaments and muscles, which keeps everyone in tip-top, playful form. But Ted has another superpower that keeps me in hearty good shape, literally. You see, when I hear his gorgeous rumbles, and when I'm petting him, my blood pressure drops. And according to scientists, I'm also 40% less likely to have a heart attack than people who don't have a Ted or a Ziggy or a Daisy in their lives. It's like living with your very own caped crusader. So the next time you're feeling under the weather, you know what to do. Cuddle two cats and call me in the morning. And don't forget to come back soon for more Science with Ted.